Hello, bro. It's show. It's it's show. Show. All right. Hello, bro. <laughs> yeah, good evening. Even though say I, I don't get joy this night, but okay. I, I don't know. I just have to do my job. Sure, sure, yes. sure. You, have to, you, have you have no choice. You have no choice. <laughs> now, do your job. Ah, so um, amazing win for United yeah. tonight against Chelsea. So I'd like to get your thoughts on the, the matchup tonight. Man, my thoughts are very positive. My thoughts are positive. You know the. Despite anything, you understand, the two clubs play wonderful football. They're like, uh, Chelsea uh, couldn't make use of their most chances. Same United. But uh, I believe uh, United play their best from the first half, you understand. They, they know that this match is a do or die affair. That they need at least from um, the lose, uh, the draw to Kalatasari. Uh, coming down and coming down to Chelsea, also they they knew that they needed to you know do something mm. tangible and uh, positive in this match. You understand? So the two club play very wonderful football. First goal, uh, first goal from uh, uh, McTominay after they uh, lose a penalty and uh, a, a goal uh, for Chelsea uh, from the first half. It was it was nice. You understand? So uh, I believe that uh, United. I wouldn't. I wouldn't want to say that uh, maybe they have. They have regained back their strength. I mean, I believe that it's coming back gradually. I mean, for this big win because I call it a big win. You know, since 2007, I started watching Man U football. Man U Chelsea has been the big fish game ever. If Man U is playing, even even Man U is playing uh, Manchester Dubai, I don't see a big deal there. But when they meet Chelsea, you're like they, they are uh, two uh, two brothers that are you know contesting or uh, for uh, inheritance from their father. I don't even know why the two even the team possess the two clubs even possess their fans. See, they, uh, even up to death, Manchester United fans don't want to see Chelsea, uh, Chelsea fans. You understand? All, the, all of them they are cataracts. Just what, what happened today? You understand? <laughs> so when Manchester United score, I mean, the, you see everyone was very calm. When Chelsea score, I mean, it was it was boom. You understand? So even though I, the Chelsea fan I was sitting with at the front seat, you know, view uh, the match was like kind of today when I go see something, man, you are not view. You understand? Me, <coughs> sorry, I. No, I don't. What what I really know, I don't know how to talk much till I'm opportune to talk. Mm. So I was like the guy. See, you know, the, they wanted to even smash my phone on the floor. <laughs> I thought I was about to go buy this one. He said, "I go buy him." Chelsea will go win. I go buy him. <laughs> I was like, "No, let's just come back second half and see what we what will happen." But believe me, Chelsea played a very fantastic football. Mm. They played well. You understand some uh, beautiful touches, beautiful power, beautiful position. Mm. But uh, Man U was the better side. Mm. Because of the three points. So. Now, now um, talking about uh, Eric Ten Hag, see the amazing selections he started with today, putting a player like Rashford on the bench. How do you, do you really feel that that kind of decision affected Manchester United's great performance today? My dear, that is the best, very best, in your understand, decision so ever. I mean, I was so glad when I see the lineup, I saw Rashford substitution. I was like, this is what this man is supposed to be doing for me. Believe me, that as soon as Rashford started that game, Chelsea would have an upper hand. In fact, if not draw, they, they would win us. Because Rashford will, will be leaking. Now, look at how Ganacho is contending. Look at how Ganacho is possessing on that. As far as Ganacho is still coming up. But now, a Ganacho of a guy is benching Rashford. That's supposed to be playing like um, uh, this guy on in, 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 in Real Madrid, uh, what, Bellingham. Supposed to play like Vinicius, uh, Vinicius. All those guys, but this guy, I don't even know what's wrong with him. You understand? But look at Ganacho. Contessa, Ganacho has been very good today with the run. You understand? Although he, uh, he loses some ball, but that is normal thing. You understand? So, him bringing Rashford in that minute, I, I, my mind was very strong because I know that uh, the, time has, the, the time is fast spent. You understand? So, that is, if you ask me, that's a wonderful, very wonderful. Now the, the another thing the hand did that uh, you know um, uh, give me joy was was to bring uh, uh, Riglion, the guy from uh, um, Tottenham. You understand? You know, you know, uh, bringing out uh, uh, Lindelof. You know, taking Luxor to, to to the central. Then taking that guy. I mean, you see, you see how it is. And that guy was trying to cover up. Um, 
cover that three or from that three now moving to 11. It, it, the guy was playing very fantastic with the, it, the fastness and you know, the potential in him, you understand, the, and the fitness. The guy is good, you understand. So I believe the, the selection to the end, I couldn't believe what I saw to the Maguire. Maguire. I couldn't believe. With three wonderful stops that could have caused us nice goals from Chelsea. You understand? I was, wow. So I, I, I give kudos to that nigga. His, 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 his confidence is coming back. Yes. So, will you really, uh, yes, you said something about his confidence coming back. Very nice because this guy has always been, we know his situation, how Manchester United fans have always been against him. But he has been able to pick off himself about that. So, but do you really think there's more to come from Maguire? Yeah, yes, 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 yes. There is. There is more. There is more. You know, you know this guy, this guy, at the initial point, he was stripped out from captaincy. Mm. You understand? Uh, he, he was he was put into cell. He said he's not going anywhere. You understand? That is a player that that want to regain back his position in Manchester United. And bro, let truth be told, Maguire will actually get back if if not if he will regain back his captaincy. Because the, the potential I'm seeing in this nigga right now is 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 more a lot a lot a lot more a lot more is is, is needed from this guy and i believe he's, he's he's going to showcase it believe me all right yeah. thank you so much i'm going to draw the curtain at this point thank you for joining me here congratulations once again thank you bro i, know you I, don't, I don't want you to feel bad i'm not just a top and small small my man <laughs> <laughs> thank you very much thank you so much have a good night united for life united for life <laughs>